Bitch, just blocking your blessings. If you so worried about me get invested, bitch, I'm a business. You wanna get in it? Go put down your phone and pick up a pen. I understand you thought you were smart. Blind the blind, you're all in the dark. I know you used to see a mediocre. I know the bar getting lower and lower. Wanna constrict me like a boa. Snake in the grass, but I got the mower. I went and put the city on my shoulders. They got my name at the top of the totem. They know about me cause somebody told them. Bitch, it's off. You know I'ma fold them. He said, What's up? What's up? What's up, everybody? Happy hump day, hump day, hump day, y'all. Oh, I slept so good. I ain't even want to get up this morning. <laughs> but here I am. Here I am. I'm here. I'm here, y'all. How you doing? Listen to my music. Seeing what's going on in the energy, y'all. Take what resonate. Leave the rest, okay? I don't know what's going to come out. I'll just be grabbing my cards at home, and then I'll just read these damn things. So, it might resonate, it might not, baby. But that's cool. Hope it helps you, though, anyway. Okay? Oh, any advice I give, I hope it helps. All right. I've never been the same, baby. Dun, 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 dun. Well, yeah. Okay. I am mindful of what I have done in the past. So somebody is learning about what they have done in the past. They are getting a realization. Like, they are very mindful of what they've done in the past, okay? So they already know. They know you might have abandoned me because of the shit I did in the past. The stupid shit I did or the shit I was doing. <laughs> somebody feel that way? They was mindful. They knew what they was doing. Okay? Half the time they do. And they feel like you have abandoned them because of this. Playing games with you. Oh no. I ain't never been the same, baby. Y'all, let's pray. Nah, I ain't trying to wish time away. But I do want to wish, like, the first half of the day to go away. Like, I'm ready to go home. Okay, now, <laughs> no, it's not the time. No, it's not the time. Somebody trying to get themselves together, though. No, it's not the time. You feel what I'm saying? Or maybe y'all saying, no, it's not the time. I ain't trying to hear all that. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. I have a clear memory of every detail of that day. So it's like it's something you can't even get over. Like, you can't get that shit out your mind. Like, the way they did that shit, the way they disrespected, the way they even try to handle you. Or, you know what I'm saying? You just like, oh, hell no. You feel what I'm saying? You like, I have a clear memory of every detail of that day. Okay? They know Somebody know what they did. They knew what they was doing, yo. Okay? They don't want to, like, admit it to you. Like, yeah, what you said that I did, and, and you said the reason I did it, yeah, you right. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, you right. I'm afraid to um to be in contact with you. They scared. You're going to read the hell out of them. I am afraid you're going to be in contact with you. Why they afraid? But I will rip. Re Y'all, why my words fucking up? I will wait for a result from you. So this person's scared to reach out to you first. Okay? They waiting for a sign to get them to okay. Like, okay. They seem cool. I feel like this person be watching you. Watching your energy or something. Somebody be watching your mood to see when they can reach out. And then they still scared to reach out even if you're in a good mood. So they're like, let me wait for them to reach out to me first. Okay? They just waiting for a simple sign. Okay? They said appearance can be deceiving, even though they're walking around acting like and looking like they all right. You know what I'm saying? They good. They really missing you on some real shit. Okay? Some of y'all, y'all wasn't suited for each other. Somebody had some more growing to doing. Okay? They really weren't ready for you. We, were, we weren't suited for each other. Maybe you need your body, baby. Fatty baby, go crazy. Okay, y'all. Mm -hmm. Let's see what else. Come on. Let you know. Never believe me, I got a body. Dun, dun, dun. Okay. I'm reminded of you by many things. Seems like somebody fucked up a good thing. If you ask me, I'm sorry for being <laughs> not being truthful with you. Okay, because that's all you wanted was honesty. Okay? What a girl wants, what a girl needs, what a girl wants, what a girl needs. A guy to be there for her. 
<laughs> what up? Brought back to the BQK. Okay. B2K. Okay. I know I messed up. I'm sorry. Okay. You are mo the most precious person in my life. Okay. That's like giving a kid a toy they weren't re ready for because they don't know how to take care of it yet. This is what the fuck this is. Okay. Now they realize you're the most precious thing in this person's life, baby. You made a difference. I desire to recapture that feeling. You give them that feeling. Got me feeling for you. I can't leave you alone. Oh, shit. You got me feeling. <laughs> and that's not even the song on the radio, y'all. These songs popping out regular. The song is on the radio right now. Is, I mean, on Pandora's Essence that I'm listening to, but... Give you all you need. Give you all you need. Okay, but baby, you irreplaceable. The way you love can never be replaced. Oh, you got them caught up in that love cycle. They were your love Bible. You gave them that Venus love. You gave them that genuine love. They never felt before. They felt that genuine touch. <laughs> Y'all got somebody like, ah, what? Like, I know I fucked this shit up. It was my own insecurities for this one. You feel me? Y'all detached right now. I had to let you go so I can so I can clear my mind. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Like, they ain't know what the fuck, okay? They like, I haven't told you everything. So they keeping some type of secrets. They secret feelings. They keeping secret feelings about you, baby, to they self. They trying to detach to get their mind right to see what they want. See if this is what they want. But they can tell since y'all been apart or detached. You know, time. You know, busy, maybe work and shit got in the way. You know, y'all got work, y'all got lies and shit. So maybe y'all ain't been around each other like that, okay? And maybe some y'all had like a misagreement or some type of shit, okay? But since this misagreement or what happened, y'all call yourself detaching from this person. You are on their mind. You always on my mind. The saying, you're replaceable. I don't know what. They reminisce of the shit y'all did when y'all spent time together. They don't remember the touch, the cuddles. Whatever it is y'all did, baby. It was so intimate, okay? They haven't told you everything, okay? They really haven't. And then they need to move. Oh, they like to use room. To do. Oh, oh, oh. I can move nobody else but you. I, I, I don't want to. <laughs> mm -mm. Oh, this crazy song came out. I said, I know you don't want to wait for me. They told you you should stay away from me. Pray for me. That's right. Pray for them, baby. You know what? If they praying for you and you praying for them, man, my heart just flitter. flitter. <laughs> it's a beautiful feeling. Somebody really love you, man. For real. I feel that shit. Damn. I'm just a fool with a witness. Use her. When a man won't choose her. Only truth, girl. I don't live a lie. Me falling. Oh. Y'all got somebody falling. The game keep calling. At the club always balling. We don't fall too hard. But they don't fall too often. But you got them falling. Damn. And even if I try, I always keep calling. And when I'm in the club, I always balling. When I'm in... I usually don't be in love. I don't fall too often, but you got me falling for you. I don't want nobody else but you. Oh, I am starving to be a better version of me. Oh, my God. This is what I like. Okay. I appreciate the wisdom I gained from this experience. Oh, so you impacted this person's life. Broken. I am shattered about the situation. Like, like they're ashamed of themselves. They, they're mad at themselves, but it's going to help them learn and fix it. You feel me? I want to have an equal give and take with you. I let my pride get in the way of our connection. You made me realize my flaws. Oh, look at me. Oh, real one. I guess I'm with them. It's a fool with her. Looking in the mirror like, ain't you scared to lose her? Like another man won't choose her. She's the really truth, girl. The truth. Wow, calling. Damn, somebody's pleading their case, bro. They can. They ooh, head up heels over you. 
Oh, I love love. Venus. I wish this never happened. But if it had happened, how would you learn, baby? <laughs> how would you learn? Damn, you flew out. What? What? You're my soulmate. Golly. Let me get the other cards now, y'all. This is cute. Nobody else but you. Oh, ah, ah. Nobody else but you. Oh, ah, ah. But you. Dum, dum. Oh, my body else. I, I don't want nobody else but you. So take that in with a reason how it fit in, y'all. Get that in where it fit in. Ooh, hi, chakra. Ooh. Green. Green. I'm going to shut up. I'm just going to pop out. I ain't going to say shit. Da, 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 da. Inspiration. You're an inspiration. Okay, you see my inspiration. Ooh, somebody too busy winning. Ooh, y'all winning the jackpot on Father. Ooh, it seems like y'all living your best life. You ain't going back and forth with these ninjas. Okay, or people. Y'all is, yo, y'all is, somebody winning right now, yo. Yo, y'all winning. Money flowing. Unexpected money, hand been itching, kissy, 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 blow it to the sky, baby. Look at you. It's like somebody finally getting some peace. Peace of mind. Somebody relaxing. Some of y'all chilling by the pool, by the beach or somewhere. Some of y'all on a yacht or a boat. Like, I don't know. Maybe you're taking a cruise. Is y'all on the cruise? Okay. Oh, what kind of force? Traveling. Personator. Hooked. Some of y'all got somebody forcing things on you, forcing their way. Somebody trying to force their way back in there. Somebody trying to make themselves a part of your life again. This is a, could be a whole different situation. Somebody's traveling to somebody. Somebody's trying to move close to somebody, okay? Somebody want to be just like you. Somebody probably want to do like, be unbothered like you. Shit, I don't. <laughs> somebody. Somebody want to win, too. Somebody's trying to copy you. Somebody hooked. Maybe they're trying to follow your lead. That's what I'm getting. I'm saying somebody's so hooked on you, they're going to follow your fucking lead. I don't know, y'all. Let me see. Oh, why y'all be sliding like that? God damn. Okay, somebody been reflecting, all right? Okay, somebody reflecting, reflecting on some shit. Somebody been fishing for comments and child services. Somebody reflecting. But when I feel child services, I don't get like social services involved or nothing. I'm thinking somebody done been neglecting their child and they really regret that shit. Like somebody really been neglecting their kids over some, like somebody been reflecting over some shit. And somebody, like, how they was trying to force shit on you. It's like something didn't work. They be trying to probably reach out to you and, and you don't say shit. They probably try to bring up an olive leaf, olive wrench, or olive branch. That's what it's called, y'all, olive branch. Okay, and um, I don't know. It's like somebody won't wait on for a reaction from you or something. It's like somebody was silently doing shit to fuck with you. Like undercover, like purposely not doing shit on purpose. And they act like they don't know what happened or forgot what happened, but they was forcibly doing that. But something, I don't know. Now that somebody can't, you know, bother you no more. It's like something don't phase you no fucking more. Okay. You've been in peace pretty much. Somebody just, they did all this because they was hooked on you. It's like this person wanted to be like you, copy you. But their true action and character was showing because it's like they wanted to be like you, but yet sabotage you at the same time. Somebody neglect their responsibilities. Somebody who was so jealous. It's like y'all was dealing with somebody who was, y'all had a child about somebody who was so jealous by you that they didn't even want to, uh, like, a tribute with the child. And they seeing, like, their life ain't getting no better playing these type of games. Like, playing, like, being, like, 
evil for no fucking reason. Like, that shit wasn't even called for. And the, and the whole time they hooked, but then you trying to... Like, how you be hooked on somebody and then trying to, like, purposely do some fucked up shit? Somebody being haunted, though, by this shit. Somebody haunted by your memories. It's giving me, like, somebody messing with, like, a somebody that, like, kind of was, like, a gain or very high, favor, you know, highly favored or something. And you sat there and tried to abuse them. Like, you didn't really have no reason to do this. It was just something within yourself that made you feel like there's some demons you was battling or some shit you was going through. It's like it was like a love. I don't know. It's giving me love and hate. It's giving me you felt like this person was gonna outgrow you type shit or something. It's like somebody dealt with somebody, did them wrong. They got like as soon as this person got their life, they've been haunted for life, or their life haven't been the same, or it's like their mental state haven't been the same. You could just really tell that they being haunted. And somebody being haunted by the memory. Somebody having some type of traumas. It's like somebody weeping what they sewing. Somebody you making somebody upset. Cause they still they seeing you win right in front of their face after they try to destroy you. Okay. Some of y'all, somebody trying to give you a dirty offer. Ooh, offer you dirty offer. Spiritual hater. I know somebody ain't trying to introduce a spiritualist to something dark or something different. It'll make it seem like it's not dark, but it really is. It's like you trying to like sabotage somebody's gifts because you hate on them. Okay, it's like somebody in good magic and somebody in dark magic. And somebody hates your spirituality, your light, and your magical powers. Because they magic only lasts for so long because it's mostly illusions. Yours is very set with good intentions and it's pure and it's like, it manifests. Somebody hates your spiritual gift and your uh, uh, spiritual balance or something like this. Like they hate, the how it's, it's like, you know, when you go to the spirituality, they show you both sides, y'all. To me personally, I feel like they show you both sides. They show you like, Okay, this is why they be drinking that blood and, 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 the, and this and that. And it shows you, like, you kind of get an understanding why they do the way they do. But everybody got free will. You make a choice. You can either do the light spiritual or you can do the dark one, like really play in darkness. You know what I'm saying? Or it depends on what high perspective you get it from. But it's like you, you rather be like, okay, I'm working with universe. I'm working with light. I'm, I don't want the moon. I want the sun. I want the light. You know what I'm saying? Like. I don't need that. I'm absorb my own energy. Like, cause maybe you like absorb, you create your own energy. Maybe cause like each spiritual person got like different jobs or like different things they good at. Some is good at telepathic. Some is good at medium. Some is good at, um, like energies. Some is good at Reiki. Some is good with like the weather. Some is good with animals. It's like you got different divines and this person was want to do with the dark rituals. You know what I'm saying? The fast track shit to make shit happen for them faster, but they got to keep doing shit or doing like sacrifices and, and blood and all that shit they gotta keep doing it but the shit you do is like coming from the universe it recycles itself it pulls it out it comes back in you bring it out it comes back in this person mad because they picked the wrong side of the fences okay maybe they shit coming faster they might look more like they up there they might look like they got more influences but you got to understand or more views or more money in this and it came fast for me shit and yours coming slow and steady it's like yours more stable humble with it like type shit it's not flashy or clack showy but you can tell like you truly like your soul is like good with the you ain't materialistic let's just say like that you ain't that shit don't move you you know the true de debts of your shit of your soul your spirit you know this shit don't come with you you know you ain't proving shit you feel me like, people got different reasons why they do shit okay to make them feel how you feel but yo how you feel about yourself come naturally within you that material shit outside of you that shit don't bother you you already know who you are within right so this person hate the part the part how strong you is with your, within yourself pretty much like and they chose the dark side you feel what i'm saying Chose dark side. You gotta remember, even on y'all, Jesus, he only had twelve disciples. Jesus wasn't famous. He ain't had no riches. Well, y'all, Jesus, as the story go, they ain't had no riches. None of that shit. Nobody didn't really know them, but they was that that person that had less people was the most telling the truth. Feel me? The deceivers gonna spread more than the truth will. You feel what I'm saying? The sin is going to have more than the truth. You feel what I'm saying? Because they need the lies to spread. Okay? They need the confusion, the illusions and shit. Okay? So that's how I'm feeling. Somebody is just, you know what I'm saying, mad. Okay? You annoying them and shit. You annoying people. You annoying 
You know, you ain't paying these motherfuckers no attention. It's like you really focus on self, okay, baby? Somebody's looking you up, trying to get research on you, trying to figure out who is this. You feel what I'm saying? It's trying to study you, get info on you, because this person's a happiness hater. They trying to figure out what the fuck you so happy for. You feel what I'm saying? It's like they looking at you like you ain't even got like that. What the fuck you so happy for? Because you in peace, baby. You in tune with yourself. You've been, you been running, getting your mind right, body right. Some of y'all been exercising. Okay. Some of y'all just in good, good with nature. Y'all just good. It's like y'all in peace. Y'all in peace. Y'all vibration is high. Y'all are glowing. Okay. Like the sun shines on you everywhere you go. Y'all moving. Because you're moving ahead. You're moving along. You... So somebody fucking with you is just a waste of time. It's making them feel like. Make them feel shame of they. They're making they. Making them feel shame. You making them look bad, bro. Y'all making them look bad. <laughs> they thought they were something till you come across with your goddamn innocent, happy go humble ass self. Your happy go lucky ass. Your sweet self. It's like you ain't got nothing negative. You ain't damn riding Miss Daisy in this bitch. Somebody's a thief. <laughs> lost. Okay? They just lost. Okay. Somebody stole their joy and they never got it back, okay, baby? Something hurt them they couldn't get back physically and emotionally. Okay, this person physically and emotionally helped hurt, okay? Somebody been talking shit. How's somebody gonna take your shit and talk shit too at the same time? It's like somebody got, you help somebody and they, and they talk shit about you. You look out for somebody and the whole time talk shit about you. Like, who does that? How you, somebody look out for you talk shit about them? What they acting like? What they hiding? Scarcity tactic. Somebody hiding that they always partying. Somebody. You dodged the bullet. This person be around too much shit. It's like, I don't know. Always party. You blocked it from. They, were, they be around negative people. They keep around the wrong type of company. And they thought since y'all two connected, goddamn, you was like that too, but really you wasn't. So now you got them judging they damn self like, well, damn, I don't really connect people like this. What the fuck is this? You just supposed to went across this person's path, that's all. But you um, blocked some negative people from negative parties, outside parties. You blocked something. Somebody was trying to hide their toxic ass ways. It seemed like somebody was really hurt, but they really like, act like they was having a good time at the ho like they act like they was having a good time and they was fine. Okay, they act like they're living a good life, but really they stress. Somebody's really capping, they making they making something seem like something that's really not, because they really hurting on the inside. But you are blocked from this, so this shit can't be connected to you. Somebody been crying. Like since you blocked these people, man. Whoever this person, they've been crying about you at night, so they act like they fine, they act like they're living a life, but at night they are lonely and they're crying and they're missing you. For real. They hate for trying to compete with you. Somebody trying to compete with you. Trying to be better than you some type of way. To the point. It's like if this was a friend, family member. And they was trying to compete. It was like they always trying to one up you. Or whatever you do. They try to do better type shit. Like they took you being single. So they married for money. But yet you still win and being single. Because you seem like you unbothered. You unstressed. And they got to worry about what they person doing. They got to worry about keeping the house clean. They got to redo do do. do Pretty much under somebody's control because they married for money. You know, they did it for money, not for love, okay? A boss daddy. And some of y'all boss daddy feel like, some of y'all, I keep seeing boss daddy. Somebody feel like somebody married them for the money. They thought it was love, but this person caught the hell out of them. They just was with them for the money, and that's fucked up. Okay? And this boss daddy is looking at somebody else genuine as hell that know that's the real deal. And they, look, they married for goddamn looks and... Cause this person look good, but they heart ain't there. Yeah, they sexy and the sex be good, but it's like they missing something. They missing the emotional part. You feel what I'm saying? They tired of dealing with these bitches. They just with them for their goddamn money and not for them, okay? They don't mind providing, but they looking for where's the fucking love at, okay? Somebody missing something genuine. They missing that genuine shit. You feel what I'm saying? Like, they successful like they're supposed to be, like a man's supposed to be to provide. But when the man get to that, he feel like if he get to that lead, whoever this person is feel like they at that spot. But now they ain't finding the genuine people. You know what I'm saying? And then somebody in the marriage just for money. 
Okay, somebody been cyberbullying somebody. So somebody you had a love affair with you and you cut off, they been cyberbullying you. They mad as hell because their games they got played out. Okay, somebody want to apologize. Something got played out and now somebody want to apologize. Okay, maybe a karmic ass friend. Okay, who you fully couldn't trust at that time or you still can't fully trust. You know, had tension and secret competition with your secret your animosity towards you. This person was really your enemy. Their job was just to stay by you, destroy you. Or, you know what I'm saying? It's like they try to like you, but they, <laughs> I don't know, they, mm -hmm. insecurities. Divination, somebody abusing divination to this queen that's rising. Okay, somebody trying to abuse some divination, seeing where you're going to be getting some money or you be giving money. Somebody going to be giving you some money. Somebody know you're about to receive some type of money. So somebody abusing divinations and, and, and they saying like wealth. But that's when you got to be careful too because you don't know if it's spiritual wealth. And spiritual wealth is health, my nigga. And health make the wealth. You feel what I'm saying? Give your body what you need to goddamn to, to create the wealth. You feel what I'm saying? Or somebody can be getting some wealth. Either way it goes, somebody trying to abuse divination and do some type of divination to keep up on you, okay? Somebody doing divination, doing reads, and they see that you are who the fuck you said you are. Okay, somebody feeling bad because they see you never had no real intention. That was all them in their own damn head. You feel what I'm saying? So that's what I'm getting, y'all. That's what I got. I hope this helps somebody. Take what resonates. Leave the rest. And watch your thoughts. I got to tell myself that, too. My mind, I be like, damn, bitch, you be manifesting shit. But sometimes you see shit. <laughs> and, I, and I be like, bitch, you forget. You can um, transmute the energy or manipulate the energy. You can, like, re resculpture it. I can, re like, re you know, body and retain the environment. But watch your thoughts. Treat us like you want to be treated. And don't be so judgmental, y'all. It's going to be all right. I hope this helps somebody. I'll probably be back later, y'all. Yeah, because I'm killing time today. But y'all stay blessed. I love y'all so much. Thank y'all for vibing with your girl, though, okay? All right. Make good decisions, y'all. Do what's best for you. Listen to yourself, your inner self. But make sure when you listen to yourself, you got the um, right mindset when you do it, okay, baby? All right. Think of everything with most hot, positive vibes, okay? And look at, you know, the best in it. Because everything in the dark ain't always, I mean, everything that looks bad ain't always bad. Look at the lesson and the blessing, okay? All right, love y'all. Bye.